What the fuck? That's what looks like Lewis when he stretches his balls. <laughs> <laughs> so these these. <laughs> mate, I'm so spotty at the moment. It's just they just won't go. You still spotty? How do you get rid of spots? Mine very toothpaste. Free. That's what you do in it. This thing that gives Sometimes. me the most spots is diet and drinking. Yeah, diet's definitely one. But if I, I eat like take away fa- facial hair, another one. If I let my facial hair grow out, it gets worse. So I don't probably have to start shaving. Spots, drinking, if I can tell, I, I, literally, it's hours. Like the morning after I wake up from a night of drinking, I've got spots. Really? Like, yeah, it's savage. It goes right through me. It's really weird. So you get it from drinking. You get it from diet. I think sugar, like, I've been having sugar more. And I do both. And I don't but... really eat sugar, but recently I've been, like, having this chocolate pudding, some ice cream, you know what I'm saying? Oh, shit, give you spots. i tell you what else does give me spots as well, and it sounds a bit stress. When I'm really fucking, yeah, like, worried and stressed, I, I, I break I, out the fuck. I remember yeah, when I started really working at that butcher's, and, for, like, literally like, two weeks in, my face was covered, Ooh. absolutely covered in spots. <laughs> Spots. It's working, man. Hello, everyone. Yeah. Welcome back to the Freeskins podcast. Best podcast. That's all I got to say. If you yeah. are listening to this or watching this and don't know that you can listen to it on Spotify, iTunes, etc., 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 Castbox, Player yeah. FM, there's, uh, all of the every this, podcast provider yeah, we're on. We're, we're on everything, uh, even Spotify, which everybody's cancelling at the moment because. Mm. Uh, but remember, we're on Spotify too, and we don't do vaccine dif- d- 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 uh, disinformation. No, no, we don't. There's no misinformation. <laughs> Take that, bold here. man. Yeah, stupid. Little... We've only been we've only been ripping on the Shh. bold caveman for the last. We've been like... th- we've been shaving gorilla, Dude, motherfucker. We've been ragging on him since like the first episode. We told yeah. you all. We well, told you. Tell you. No, no, it's not. Like I don't like him. It's just like that one listened. He's just. I don't, I don't get why he's the top dog. No, I don't get it either. I, he's got some great podcasts. Like some mm. of his podcast episodes are amazing. But he's him as a person. He's just dull and boring. Maybe that's why he, he makes his guests shine because he's so dull and boring. That might be what it is. Because uh, see, I, I I don't feel, I don't know. I think he's a moron. Yeah, but I think yeah. everyone's a moron. Yeah, mm-hmm. we're morons as well. So, yeah, we, so have, we don't have yeah. nowhere, nothing to say about but the, that. Uh, I'm the dumbest person I know. The, the, yeah. uh, what's more su- su- surprising to me. But then his podcast has been big as he sells out arenas with his stand up comedy. Oh, stand up comedy. Oh my Ooh! God. Dude, have you watched his Netflix special? It's Ooh! so bad. All of them, like all two or three of them, are just like he goes on like 20 minute rants about the ins and outs of cer- certain kinds of like psychedelics. He's like, so this psychedelic induces this endorphin in your head. And, blah, blah, blah. and it's like, nobody in this arena cares, Joe. About how DMT works. <laughs> that like, being said, Joe, up, Joe would love to come on your podcast, and then yeah. you're probably strapped for guests at the moment because no one wants to come on. But we'll be on there. We'll buddy. come on. We'll we love we'll you. We we read. We do love you. Stand I wouldn't say really. I love you, but I think that people being maybe mean. I don't really know. I don't really care because, like, <laughs> the thing is, is that people act like him. St- Talking shit about vaccines is what's changing their minds. They, they, it's not changing people's minds. It's just validating people's already existing opinions. You know yeah, what if I mean? you already think that way, it's not going to be like, oh, I follow everything Joe honest, Rogan says. Yeah. He might yeah, even be yeah, right. Yeah, yeah. I don't even know much about the vaccines to be honest, myself. I just if, got him. If, I just got him to shut, if to shut the dumb, government if up. If you're dumb enough to get your <laughs> your advice from Joe Rogan, you probably deserve to just <laughs> well. <laughs> <laughs> insert what you think I was going to yeah. say I think, you can, I think you can cure COVID with like elk jerky or some shit like I, I am interested what elk jerky would taste like though yeah Does I've had some weird jerkies I don't it. think I had elk though no. I went to I've America had, years had, ago yeah, yeah, I, had, jerky. I, had, yeah. I, had I had ostrich I've had ostrich I think I had ostrich as yeah. well I had like some I had, it I wasn't that good up, like, I wasn't interested I remember all of them just kind of tasting very much the same like jerky yeah. do you know what I think yeah. I think ostriches and crocodiles to me they look like prehistoric creatures oh well alright so <laughs> I don't know if it was the last podcast or some podcast ago I think it was it's, the one before we said it was my turn to do the yeah, topic and yeah, you said yeah. prehistoric animals so we're gonna. That's what, literally the next hour. We're gonna sit. And we're gonna talk about prehistoric animals. No, because we're gonna talk about sex somehow. Yeah. It's How would you have sex with that yeah, one? Yeah, I know. <laughs> you guys are so horny at the moment. I can I'm, see it coming. I'm the one that's not bad. I'm I pretty can see good. It I've reined it in, man. I've castrated myself in the mind, so I don't bring it up on the podcast. You know what I mean? That's called a lobotomy, isn't it? Huh? I'd rather have a <laughs> bottle in front of me than, than a, a front of a lobotomy. lobotomy. Anyway, guys. So basically, Matt. 
said. Don't blame this on me. No, no, okay. So you basically, you have been banging on about these no. little mu- these Ma- fucking okay. mutts. Let's, let me give you a little bit of like a background and all of this. I did paleontology at university. Everyone called me a dinosaur bummer because <laughs> as soon as you think paleontology, not everyone. It was just me. <laughs> yeah, it was just Matt. <laughs> I did that as well. Everyone thinks you, like you do bummer, They think paleontology. Though. They think Jurassic Park dinosaurs. The thing is, is that, and I've always said this, that dinosaurs are they, they're cool, but there's so much more interesting shit out there. I've just looked for my list. Maybe not chosen the best representatives, <laughs> but in my defence, <laughs> why are you supposed to? Like, you're an idiot. And nah. you just pick like a, a fucking slug that's a little bit different colour. <laughs> <just laughs> Some slap prehistoric you. slug. We can't actually tell the colour of um, Ooh, prehistoric. That freaked me out. We can't tell the colour of prehistoric animals because why not? the. The, like, Did no one take a picture? The pigment doesn't really preserve. It's the it's the shape and form of them and the bones that preserve. It's not the that turn into rock. Because that what a fossil is is it's not the actual bone. It's the bone where it was has yeah, been, been replaced by a new mineral. Greg had to describe this to me because I was like, Greg, let's get like a dinosaur fossil and blend it and sniff yeah, the yeah, dust. Yeah, yeah. And Greg was like, like it's, it's not a, actually dinosaur bone. It's, it's, like, a, oh. it's a rock in the shape of. Yeah. Yeah. Like oh, the, I see. It's where like the other, the yeah. old, it's fallen away, and it's what's mm. left of like. It's like yeah. hollowed out when you hollow something out, put cement in it. Yeah. Okay, you have the shape of it. Mm. Yeah, but it's not the actual. Right, I'm with you. Yeah, yeah, it's exactly. And you right. went and studied this. I've just learned it in How about shark five teeths? minutes, Greg. <laughs> How about shark teeth? Oh, remember shit. when we were googling for about three hours if I could swallow a shark I'm teeth? I'm pretty sure. I think shark teeth are yeah, look, 100. Yeah. Could I swallow teeth. one though? What was the consensus on that when we... you wouldn't digest it though would you no my, the consensus was you'll be fine it's just calcium isn't no, it? no but it's spiky carbonate. yeah it would hurt coming out we you. can or it wouldn't blend it then blend it blended shark teeth mm. megalodon tooth we get a megalodon tooth <laughs> there is a... you just smash it with a I'm hammer and you over all my words sniff it like a lime <laughs> sniff a line of megalodon <laughs> sniffing up megalodons <laughs> Chompers. Um, I did leave out Megalodon because I thought everyone already knows that. That's good. Well, oh yeah, they're my favourite. There is a. You know about them, and like you don't know much. So if you know about them, they come. <laughs> Fuck you, you don't know much. <laughs> so with Fucking Megalodon, dinosaur yeah. bummer. Huh? For anyone who doesn't know what a Megalodon is, it's like twice the size of a great white. It's just shark. a great white shark, but like super sized. Everything was super sized. Oh, okay. It existed like four million years ago, I think. I can't remember. Ten million. That was... Is it super sized it because the oxygen was smaller or something, and they needed bigger lungs or something? <laughs> nah, something. nah, nah. Now, nah. nah, the, 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 the only thing about that is because um, back in the day, insects used to be bigger because there was more oxygen in the atmosphere. Because the way that insects breathe, they don't have lungs. They literally have like little holes in them all over them, and the air just, just breathe through the skin. Yeah, the air just goes through it. And, and when there's more oxygen, that's more efficient, so they can get bigger. Why don't humans animals? work like that? We should work like that. Because yeah. your lungs can go wrong. Nah, Why nah, don't nah. I just sit and absorb yeah, but then, air? Yeah, like... but then we would be like, you know, like how like reptiles and all that shit are like really slow moving. They don't really do much. They just sort of like lay there, and then they do like a short. Are you a activity. reptile? <laughs> yeah, yeah, exactly. Hey, I, I do much. I, I, mate, I do more exercise than both of you guys put together. You probably you do. Don't. I don't do Okay, shit. I used to. I don't anymore. I haven't in the last, like, half a year done any exercise, like, to be fair. Anyway, let's move on to the actual prehistoric animals. Mm. I'm excited to show you guys some of my favourite. I'm kind of, like, dubious about this one. All right, so I the feel cool... like you're going to troll us. Have oh, you... the old mega dubious. Ah, that's my, Matt, that's Matt, Matt good... always says this. Matt, Matt. No, no. Are you showing us on the tablet? Yeah, I've got... So I've got a tablet. Uh, the pictures have come up on the podcast. If... To be honest, if you if you listen to this, you then you're not gonna miss out the pictures. But if you hear it, hear the word. To be honest, we, we tried to describe it a little. They bit. are stupid Latin words. We're so an you're educational... gonna hear you're gonna hear these stupid Latin so words don't, and try and type them in. Don't show them. Don't show it to the. Yeah, yeah. Thing yeah, yeah you can just... show us, and I'll I'll put the pictures up. But right. we are an educational podcast, and it's all no, about. No, don't say that. Shut up. And it's all yeah, about yeah, how yeah. you best learn. So if you'd yeah. rather listen and learn. Or you'd rather watch. We cater to both of those things, so you we, can we you can watch us right now. Yeah, we are. You learn it. You yeah. learn it. Stuff well, all the time. Well, what do you learn? How fucking? You're not learning anything of any worth, but like you, I mean... le- you learn how our brains work. You learn mm. us as people. Yeah, that's what you learn. That's education. You're learning about what you could be like if, if you'd you... have f- failed at everything you'd. Yeah, try if, you, and... if you fucked up in life, this, you could. Yeah, this is what your life would be like. Like ours, it's pretty good. <laughs> I feel pretty good. That's that's. Absolute hog shit. Because we do. I I used to try and get around, like, because you're allowed educational things yeah. on YouTube. It, yeah, like, yeah. Oh, it's educational to watch a man vomit into a leaf blower and then fucking. But it is. It is because you're learning what happens yeah, when that. Does. 
It, it, how many times have you sat is. and thought, what would happen if you vomited into a leaf blower? Uh, well, all the time know. until I saw. Yeah. Now you know. so, well, you yeah. don't know now because it's not, it. yeah. Yeah. half of our educational stuff they like to take down. Yeah, I but, know. Mm. They're, they're, yeah. they're, they're spreading misinformation they on are. YouTube. Google, Google seems to have, like Google as a whole, seems to have an issue with this thing called education. I don't, I think, uh, you know, in my personal opinion, they don't, they don't care for it. I think they're trying to make people dumber. Mm. You know, they don't need to. They don't really need to try that, to be honest. That's true. If apps make people dumber, then they're more likely to use the app longer, right? I guess so. Yeah, that's fair. But then again, they've made the thing is that Google and YouTube have made people super dumb, and then China with TikToks come in, <laughs> and they've stolen all the dumb people, haven't they? No, no, no. This is this is a theory I heard about TikTok. This wow. is not a conspiracy theory. Please do not ban me, YouTube. <laughs> China. Creating TikTok <laughs> oh, to less to just to, just to make American children stupid because <laughs> no think about how it how hard do you have to try that's, no but that's like, the next level of warfare it's not going to be nukes is it because like, oh, we're going to get nuked back it's just, yeah. we'll, we'll make your children dumb mm. that is <laughs> genius. It's clever, we isn't it? We can't do it back to them, can we? Yeah. Because they got like the big firewall. They ban it all. We it's did. Like, just, yeah. they don't, they're not allowed YouTube. We started off this podcast by having a pop at Joe Rogan for spreading misinformation. And then no, we, we're not. We're not saying. Oh, shit. Out with that, like, we're not saying that this is a truth. We're saying no. It's, uh, it's a theory. It's see, a theory. See, yeah. Joe Rogan would be like, uh, uh, "Vaccines definitely cause like A's in your brain or some dumb. Well, I don't know, some gorilla shit. <laughs> <laughs> steak, steak, yeah. steak. Anyway, mm. so we're just saying that it's a nice theory. But it's not necessarily true. No, but right. it would make sense. But stranger and more evil things have happened in the world. Very, you know, yeah. not that long ago. You know, like look at like what they did in like Cambodia. Like, or, do you know what I mean? Like anyone that was smart or j- just get rid of them. Like, mm. so it's making someone else's kids dumb. I guess is not could be. That's true. It's not too far fetched, really. But you know, could be. All right, boys, let's get into the meat of it. All right, yes. boys. Let's start bumming some prehistoric so, animals. Dinosaurs. Yeah. Everyone loves them. There were, was an age of the dinosaurs, the age of the dinosaurs, where they ruled the planet. They, you know, herbivores and carnivores, everything was a fucking dinosaur for some reason. How the fuck was everything a dinosaur? Yeah, but they're not just like dogs knocking But before them. that, sorry, there was something else. They were called synapsids, all right? And we are descended from them. Synapsids. And they, yes, synapsids, and they ruled the planet before the dinosaurs. So our people, you know, they got beaten up by the, got beat. I don't know. I don't think we were oppressed what, by the dinosaurs. Basically, a, a mass extinction killed off all, like most of our ancestors. Dinosaurs came in and swooped us up, and then ruled well, for literally. a bit. And then the dino, then the asteroid came and killed those motherfuckers, and we came back. You know, it's like a, it's, yeah, it's like a well, that's, revenge is, story. Isn't that like what? <laughs> it is. Is, yeah, but that might happen again, you know. That's but, what I was. That was my first mm, thought. We could do another swap. These ancestors still laid eggs and did like some weird, you know, kind of weird shit like that. We don't know if they had hair or not, so I'm going to show you some pictures of, of these what motherfuckers. They think that these that, look they, like. they, we are descended from these motherfuckers. Whoa! Now, that these looks... are these are ferapsids. They're a certain kind of synapsid. That's you know like what that a... looks like what? Um, uh, chupacabra. Yeah, yeah, it does. Oh, it's like, yeah, it's like a long... mashup of like ten different animals. Yeah. It's like an alligator and, these, and a these... leopard. Yeah, and a, but it's also a, a reptile because it laid eggs. But it's, it, they call them mammal-like reptiles. So we're descended from reptiles, but they're mammal-like because they are the they ancestors have, like, of mammals. Yeah, they're the, well, they're the, the, mm. they're the ancestors of mammals. Right? But it's like saber so, like as well. With, like, the yeah, like it, it kind of <clears> like. <throat> Here's another one. This is a Gorgonopsid. <laughs> it's a like a Gorgonopsid. Dog, dog with a short spine. Because you remember... <laughs> <laughs> it does. Look like a dog with a short it spine. It does. It does. It does. It does. It does. <laughs> I'll put them side by side up. Like... So anyway, the... <laughs> so, you know, that that this is like the carnivore sort of ones. And, then you know, you've got the herbivore sort of ones. How do we, how do few, we know about all of these? Now, these, these, this, this, this one here is the sort of one that would have survived... The uh, the mass extinction why that, and then lived during the dinosaur times these, because just, this is not real because these this like is, true these, these true little motherfuckers all right they can hide underground while the dinosaurs are around stomping about 
Yeah. I so they survived. So. These mother- all these guys didn't survive. They're all dead. Look at that thing in the top right. Yeah, yeah man. It's like a Komodo dragon. Okay, like, the thing is, is that we don't know... The short spine. Like I said, the skin and, like, fur and stuff like that doesn't preserve well. Colour doesn't preserve well. So, so we don't know. These this are is, just... This, we know what the skeleton looks like, how to arrange it, what the yeah. muscles might have looked like, but... Everything Speculate. else is a bit. It's kind of just a lot of estimated, it, yeah. like guess. Yeah, it, it's just a it's an educated guess. Yeah, you know, you look at animals nowadays. You look at morphology. You know, Wait, stuff so like that. You're saying that the, these guys came along, then they got extinct. They got extinct, and the mass uh, the mass extinction was the biggest mass extinction of all time. It's called the Great Dying. It's so big, all right? really like it. it killed off like triple the amount of species that the fucking asteroid did that killed the dinosaurs. Holy it? Fuck. it killed like everything. So how long ago was this? Uh, well, like three hundred fifty million years. Three hundred million. So there was years. no dinosaurs at the, in this period. No. Uh, so after this happened, you know these little motherfuckers survive, but also some reptiles survive and they evolved into dinosaurs. Right. So what, what's this whole thing? I don't know if this is true. Um. What's this whole thing of like we we're like water mammals, like we were them, and then we evolved to live in the water, and then we came from the water back onto the land. Is I don't know. I've never heard this thing. It's probably that's why we have the water reflex. Did you hear this? From I've heard this thing. No, which like, no, I don't we, know. Any, but all I like, animals have water to... reflex. Even reptiles have a water reflex. Because if you're an animal and you fall in the water, you can have a reflex. Yeah, but to the water. like I mean, look at a lot of Americans. They look a little bit like manatees. That's just weight. <laughs> I seen a. I <laughs> saw a woman on TLC and she looked like a manatee. Okay, it his is another one. You want to go down like this, an English this, pub mate or a, or, a, or this like one's a workers' the, union? They them, all look like that. Uh, yeah, a bit me. more diverse with fur. So whoa, that's cool. So yeah, it's pretty Looks cool. Like whales. I actually quite like it. Look at the size of that thing's head on the bottom left. Yeah, what's an elephant in it with no um, trunk? No nah, man. That's Do you want to just change the settings on there, Greg? Yeah, what is that that they're eating? It keeps, uh, like the. Ah, don't worry about it, man. Like, it's not like any of them are seeing yeah. it. Anyway, it's cool, huh? So mm. that's it. That, so basically, synapsids. Our our ancestors ruled the planet. Dinosaurs, you know, took over little bitches, and then we took it back. And we've gone back. It's like a movie. It's a revenge story. I reckon they're gonna get us back though. But we'll have fucked the world. Yeah, yeah but you've got to remember. So they come, they who, come back. The world will fix it. If we yeah, all die, the world will fix itself. Who are like the ancestors of years. dinosaurs? The only ones that survived. Birds. Because hmm. uh, birds are dinosaurs, aren't they? Yeah. These motherfuckers, they're waiting. They're waiting. They're, they're up there in the skies. They're exactly. fucking sitting about. Asteroid, they're waiting. They're, mate, they're like, mate, I'm <laughs> yeah. going to get in the sky. I ain't getting... We've got to get rid of the birds. Yeah. We've got to gather them all up. After the asteroid, they're like, I ain't staying around. Fuck this. We gotta get rid of the birds. We gotta do something. It's, it's like Alfred Hitchcock. <laughs> They're gonna start taking. He, he predicted it. And think gotta... about how smart some of these motherfuckers are. Those crows. Yeah, crows. <clears throat> imagine can't trust a, cr- a crow. Imagine a dinosaur with a crow brain. Oh mate, now that is just recipe mm. for disaster. I saw a video the other day of a um a seagull like swallowing a pigeon whole. <laughs> just picks it up and just has yeah, it. They, I hate like, seagulls. It just so gulps much. it like. I probably say do that. I say this every podcast, just, but yeah, I hope you do, you do they hate all them. go extinct. I cannot stand them. I hate seagulls. Anyway, let's move on. We still need to do that seagull video. I mean, I just need to look at my. Someone did that recently. Whatever. What you like glued chips all over yourself? Yeah, but someone did that recently. I've I've been talking about that for years, and someone, some guys from Australia did it. Really? Yeah. Ah, right. I didn't watch the video though. It would. Be Here we horrible. go. This is our next one. This is a dunk. Oh, Jesus. This Christ. is a Dunkleostus. <laughs> dunk Dunkleostus. I can't pronounce that. I'm not that. That is incredible. Okay, so... I've never seen that before. Yeah, so this is armoured... This is an armoured jaw. So the entire, like, head and skull is, like, one massive um, plate. Yeah? Yeah. And the teeth aren't teeth. They're just sharp bits of the plate. Yeah, because it looks... It's just yeah. more of, like, it's own this motherfuck- head. Like- <laughs> okay. This I'm- is, like, the most animated Dude. and happy you're ever going to see, Gregor. Yeah, right. and He's this- loving check this, this right Check now. this shit out, man. All right, ready? This motherfucker made armor ir- irrelevant, all right? Because oh, ar- around that time, you think about like a lot of prehistoric animals. This is like before, you know, this is before 
even mammals, before reptiles, before everything. This is when it was just fish. There was nothing but fish. Yeah. Well, there was nothing on the land at all. They, these guys are the placoderms. Placoderms are the ancestors of all um, fish. So literally... All our, fish come so from So also that. our ancestors... Well, not specifically that, but like a smaller version of that. Okay. They're, they're the, the monsters of the period. Yeah, fuck me they are. How big so would that thing have been? Our ancestors are literally this, but like smaller. All right? And these motherfuckers, I'm telling you what, back then... It was so hard to eat shit because everything's armored. You like think about all of like sea scorpions and all that sort of stuff that were big back then. Yeah. You like, whenever you see like really far back in time, it's always like trilobites. You know, they got all their armor. This motherfucker, look at that mouth. He's cutting through that armor. He's gonna eat those. That is cool. Eat that shit up. Do you know what? You can see why religious so, people really do just doubt the whole go. evolution so that, thing because mm, even I'm having a tough yeah, time believing this. So this shit. is this is size comparison. Human. Holy big boys! Fuck. So that's all those holes. So that's surely. that's an actual preserved. That is cool. Head. Look, it looks like an like a armored helmet. Like yeah, that's what it is. Mad. It literally is just a, a a plate helmet. That's fucked. Yeah, no, and that's like that's it. where jaws come from. Jaws are our jaws are literally descended from mm. these plates mm. 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 that they had in the mouth. Don't really, Dunkleosaurus. Yeah. Before that, vertebrates Torelli. didn't have jaws. You know, have you ever seen like lampreys? They got like big suckers and they don't yeah, have jaws. Yeah, yeah, I hate them things. Yeah, yeah. So I don't like big, that's, big that's, leeches. That's what vertebrates look like before the jaw evolved. I don't like anything in the sea. It's funny that like everything on <clears> land has like changed and got, but <clears> everything <throat> in the sea has always been horrible and scary. <laughs> yeah, it's dude, always been. Oh, the, dude, like, it's terrifying. It's like that it's, thing is a mixture of of like an anglerfish and a shark. Yeah, yeah, it's yeah, yeah. fucking mad, and it almost looks a bit like with the. Do you know what it reminded me of? Because obviously, like, it's got no teeth, but mm. it's like it's a, It looks a bit like a snapping turtle. Yeah, you know, yeah, with like yeah, the yeah. front. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's yeah. like yeah. that because like, it, it's the same sort of principle. Yeah, because it's, it's not, not teeth. It's, it's, not teeth, it's, it's actual it's, like. Yeah, it's, it's part of the beak. Anyway, cool. We're moving on to something that exists around the same time, but yeah. on land. Oh, okay. now, I told oh, you, God. reptiles and shit didn't exist mm-hmm. back then. Oh God! So what lived on land? Slugs. <laughs> yeah, literally things like slugs. Yeah, but is that it? Trees hadn't evolved yet. The only plants that lived were like small little shrubs ferns and, and stuff. Not even ferns yet, right, man. Okay. Literally like mosses and stuff like that. Like yeah. really small plants. So why can't you so make a tree but you what, can make what like grew, a what grew, Yeah, but what grew big instead of trees? Motherfucking mushrooms! <laughs> Look at these motherfuckers! Whoa! They're eight meters tall! That's a mushroom. That's a mushroom. What? So like a sort of... Like if like you, could, mushroom, you like could cut into that and like sh- take mushrooms... Like, that you eat. eat it. You could eat this shit. No, yeah. could you eat it? Yeah, you could eat no, that. No, it wouldn't be poisonous. We don't think there's. It was poisonous. Well, mushrooms are pretty. You never know. That is fucking mental, though. They look like big dicks. Just yeah, man, standing proud. And that's it. That that was literally eight foot. That's what the whole of the planet looked like, pretty much all the way across. It was just so. Why is small it easier? Little grass and fucking. Why is it easier to grow a mushroom than a tree? What do you mean? I guess. Why was it easier for a mushroom to evolve than a well, tree? Because a tree. Just didn't evolve yet. It's just that's it. What we didn't have, tr- but isn't. Hang on. So basically, trees are where all the oxygen so, comes from, right? No, no, so, phytoplankton. So like yeah. algae in the water. Oh, uh, when, okay. when people were like, so, so I guess yeah. there wasn't as many shit, things. Shit, in like, the forest. Shit. Well, the, well, the, the, the phytoplankton would take. Well, they care actually of us. think that the reason that plants. I'm joking. Began to grow on land is you know, places like riverbanks are quite decent for yeah. like most life to grow, but as you surely go, don't want to do the light thing on that. Yeah, yeah, I'll be fine. Yeah, right. As as the um as mushrooms came onto the ground though, they because you know I don't know if you know how mushrooms work. They have like small little things called hyphae that like come off them. And stuff yeah, like I knew that. that. And they rip up things apart. So basically, that's what caused soil to exist. Like as we know it, before that, it was just like loose rubble and shit like that. And the rubble. Al- and the yeah, but the out. Al- you know what? Where'd I mean? the rubble didn't have concrete from? back then, you bellend. Like, you it, know what I mean? Like, what's it, Syria? Okay, you know when you go to a beach yeah, and it's all sandy and shit. You know what I mean? Like things would look like yeah, that. Okay, like, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah I feel We're that. just Greg. You, you know joke. I mean? You find everything funny but and joke about I mean, everything. You, until... you... No, you can't make fun. No, of the thing is, fucking... the thing is, I wasn't. No, even, no, like, my, no, no, no. My, my, my issue is, I don't know if you're taking the piss or you're I just being stupid. I wasn't. I was like, what do you mean, rubble? It's so hard to know. No, I was just. It's another nice little picture. That's. Fucking that would be cool, ridiculous. It? Cool. Speaking Sorry. of really tall trees, actually, quickly, just to go off topic, I was speaking to a mate the other night. Do you know the tallest tree in England, not in the UK, because there's one in um, Scotland, the tallest tree in England is in the New Forest. 
Oh, really? We yeah, should we should there. go and see it. Yeah. I saw a video, it's like a red, because there's a real small section, I think it's by like Lindhurst, where obviously in like the Victorian times, mm. going and like collecting just random weird wild trees was like a thing that they did. And there's mm. a patch in the new, like, where there's just all these random trees from all over the world. Yes, like people have been yeah. putting seeds Yeah, and it's there. a, it, it, I think it's a redwood, and it's like 59 foot or something like it's fucking let's go. it's ginormous let's go climb there's it there's two standing next and one's ever so slightly taller than the other but it's the, the, like I saw a video of it it doesn't do it justice like it's it's let's climb it. massive the, it's wide at the bottom it's like there's, nine fucking there, there's a redwood near us I've, I don't really want to say exactly where yeah but... That yeah, there's mm. mass, I think the bottom the mass bottom mass diameter is it's like it's like nine meters mm. like it's it's oh, yeah. humongous yeah but yeah, um, go back to your weird mushroom we go yeah. trees. So anyway, to the, the story of why... Tree skins. The soil. is Soil is literally... You know, back in the day, it, it was just like sandy mud shit. Yeah. And then the mushroom <clears> started, <throat> you know, utilising it. The and that created guy. soil that was rich. I like, love how passionate... Like, you know what I mean? Like, it was like... Professor it be, of this became bullshit. became like... Like, came rich... Why did you not do finish this at uni? Did you not finish this? Uh, illness. I left because of illness. Mm-hmm. Start it again. I might have to. I I, I think about it. I you love this shit, it, man. Are you Clearly, serious? Like... It's, it's cute, isn't I'm it? I'm getting it's a little kick yeah. out of seeing you. Yeah, like... but anyway, can we can we finish <laughs> talking about these motherfucking <laughs> mushrooms? Nice sorry, you, sorry, Professor. Keep so going. Anyway, it's your own so time you're wasting. The mm, mushrooms yeah. made this, like, basically made soil that was nice for plants to grow on. And that's right. It. And, that's and that's when the trees started. And so, like, yeah, but so it took a while to evolve. Um... You know, like bark and stuff like that, because back then mm. it was just all floppy and shit. Yeah, you need like you need structure, don't you? To you know build a. It's like your shaft. You, you know when it's floppy. It's you, like your shaft. Uh, yeah. Greg, you yeah, with the second you one. You know in. what I mean, though. Like you, you need to have something in there to add the rigidity. You know, make rigidity. Yeah, you know, make it make it really. I only bought some Viagra earlier. Really? really? Yeah, I just want to try it. You guys another one. So that's some weird river animals. Okay. When did they become magic? So that's what it looks like. What do you mean? Oh, I don't, we don't know. Hey. Like I said, we... Magic what? mushrooms. The, just the form of things preserves. It's not the actual chemicals. We it really would never know. You need that. to do magic. You need to do mushrooms. Okay, so the next I, one... I, if I ever do magic mushrooms, it'd be on this podcast or a live do. stream. Oh, there's no... You won't. You can't do it on a podcast. That, that's funny. They're ridiculous. No, honestly. Like you two it would be hilarious and you'd watch it back and you'd be like sober and you'd be like, we can't use any of Why it. Why not? Because it would be giggling nonsense. For that's four- funny. <laughs> Some people do <laughs> like that. Well, like, it's true. No, but you go. You can't form like... You get like half of a sentence. By the time I've said what I've just mm. said now, you, <laughs> you just go off and you don't even remember what you were talking yeah, about. Yeah. It's savage. No, that's funny though. Like, <laughs> it is quite funny. But, yeah. You guys just reel me in. Go All right, you ready? Sorry. Go yeah, go on. What's the next one? Go on, so Greg. it's not a mother- it's not Professor it's Greg. not a paleontology thing. Prehistoric animals without talking about sharks, but we know the megalodon. Mm. Bit boring. Everyone talks about it. Mm. So I'm going to give you these motherfuckers. Look at that shit. Whoa! Right? That's not a tongue. That's his fucking jaw. That's his straight up his what? fucking jaw. It's just mental, isn't it? It makes no sense. That's not real. <laughs> it that's is. like a fucking. It's that's actually. A, there's got... a fossil. There's the fossil of the Yeah, but teeth. all fossils look like that, don't they? Yeah, that's, no, they that's don't. An ammonite, all fossils that's not like... an ammonite. That, they, all fossils are when, swirly. Little, when they like... first saw this, they thought, oh, it's an ammonite. But after in closer inspection, it is a fucking jaw of a shark with shark it's teeth. It's even in got it. the teeth. Like on the outside of it, like check these motherfuckers. That's so that's stupid. No, I'm glad that one died. When it out. bites, does that bit so, that's curled up? Yeah, go, no. Like... So what it does is because back then, like with the uh, the fucking fish, everything's armored and strong. Yeah, it's got uh, armor on it. So what it does that would is wrap a... it, it, it yeah. impels them with that, and then it pushes them up into. There's like a plate in the okay, top of its mouth. Cool. Plate in the top of its mouth that's really hard, and it just jams it, jams it against it, and crushes it open. Look at that one. That These one's are, got like that's like a yeah, fucking wood. Yeah. That's like a buzz saw. Like yeah, so that's like closely related. Um, these aren't technically sharks though. They're technically. Do you know what a chimera is? A chimera is like a. It's closely related to yeah. sharks. Okay, so you, you know what I'm talking about. So yeah, um, I do. They're like a closely related species to shark, but so they're they're cartilaginous. So they don't. They're not bony fish like um. So they they cartilage instead of bony. Oh, okay. Because it's bony like fish and car- cartilage fish. Right. You might want to put that on charge, Craig. They just come up with a battery thing. Oh, okay. There's a there's a charger just behind you there. So um, anyway, yeah, yeah, that's that's, that's cool. This huh? is mad. Maybe if I was taught like this at school, I'd have taken more notice. That's it, isn't it? But that's my the thing. science teacher used to stick Brainiac on and then just be like, just yeah. do what the fuck you want for an hour. Come on, man, John Tickle. 
John, I was John, in the lower set. Like obviously they were being taught shit in the higher ones, but they gave up with all of us kids. Like they were just like, why, why just watch John it? tickle. Anyway, as I was saying, teachers seem to have, you know, they just a lot of teachers are just there to get paid, and that's yeah. fair enough. I but the thing mine, is, is right? that if you want to get like kids to really learn, you got to get the flashy Show shit. Show them this shit. That's how you br- you bring them in with the flashy shit, and then you get to the boring stuff. Yeah, that's how you do it. Mm. So when are you gonna get to the cool stuff, Greg? <laughs> um, yeah, I think that thing looks dumb. It is. It, I that's why I included it because it's probably the most. It's mental. It's the most stupid one out of all of them. I just it just doesn't make any sense. It reminds me of that like bottom tooth from uh, paleontologists still sit and argue about this fucking it, shark all the time. That family what, guy? it was no like what the whole point of the jaw was. People still argue about it all the time. Do you remember? It must tooth have from a purpose. Uh, family guy. <laughs> <laughs> Remember that? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> that's what it that's, reminds me. That's of. the Sorry. thing is that like everything that everything that an animal has must have evolved because it's good for survival. For a specific, yeah. yeah, to survive. So you have to think, shit. What the fuck kind of world did he live Unless in? Unless these guys what helped. were just like really developed, and it was just like a fashion statement. That's true. It could, it could have been sexual. It's like a mohawk. Like well, it's just got. Like, yeah. a, a lot of things evolve as a what they call it, a se- like sexual, um, mm-hmm. sexual selection. So like peacock feathers, they don't ah. exist. Peacock feathers don't help them survive. They help Female them fucking attract what, mates. What were these things called? Uh, Imagine that thing going down on someone. Helicoprions. So female helicoprions, right? Were probably like whoever's got the biggest curly fucking. Yeah, like... That's a good theory. I like that. You could be a paleontologist. He can, yeah. pr- he can protect me more. I don't like. Know. All right, like, now are you ready? I got ready for the next one, boys. Yeah. Yeah, All right, yeah, well, so yeah, we were talking yeah. about gorillas, yeah? No, okay, we were talking yeah, about yeah. gorillas. Yeah, we were earlier. We were talking about the gorilla man. Joe Rogan's one. a fucking gorilla. <laughs> Shaking gorilla. gorilla. You ready? Here we go. Have you ever heard of a gorilla horse? <laughs> That's not real. <laughs> yes, he was. This yes, is, he was. It's this... not a gorilla. It's like a giraffe <laughs> with is, a. Fucking... Yeah, it's like a horse. It's a horse gorilla. I've seen these before. It's so, like a giraffe, a horse, and a bear. They're called with tra- a cow's head. Chalicotherium, like. and they are closely related to tapirs, horses. Yeah, it looks like a tapir. And what's the other? And rhinos. Do you remember our mate? Uh, you had the foreskin of a tapir's nose. Yes. Carous. So anyway, uh, <laughs> these guys, yeah, they're, they're you've seen it. Basically, you? just gorilla giraffes. <laughs> I'll tell you afterwards. Yeah, you definitely, that, you definitely right. seen his penis. There's a few other different ones. A few like small That's species. That's fucking ridiculous. And these guys, just, you just be chilling. Can you ride it? Yeah, the, the one thing I hate about... Where would you put the saddle? Like on its neck? Yeah, you, I'd put it on like like just up, just above its back. Yeah, it looks yeah. like a camel. Yeah, like that hump bit. You but the, get... the, that's the same sort of like group of mammals. That, speed? that number three though, Very that slow. is literally like a tapir's head though. I don't like, know if you've heard is... of uh, ground-eating sloths. They existed like ten thousand years yeah, ago. Yeah, they're cool. Ground-eating sloths. They're huge. Yeah, they were the massive sloths that lived in North America before um, humans. Came How massive them. are we talking? You're probably like two, three meters. A sloth. They're huge. Yeah, 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 yeah. and they, they would just. Got Brian's. Nothing would really bother to try and eat it because it's just like, I can't bother. Mm. You know I mean, it's too big. They when animals really, get to a certain size, they they really animals have... just don't bother. What do it. sloths really actually eat? Because they're like, are they just gr- trees? Because sloths only go down. <laughs> they just <laughs> eat trees. Sloths only... No, they don't. <laughs> <laughs> they eat like fruit and veg <laughs> and yeah, stuff. Yeah, leaves. Sloths sure. stay in the trees all the time, don't they? And they only come down like once a week to do a shit and then they go back up, don't they? Is it? Yeah. Kind of. Yeah. I went to London Zoo when and there was a. Put, like, put out a tree? Saves the tree. No, I'm almost certain. That's correct me if I'm wrong. If anyone knows anything about sort, but I'm almost certain they live in the tree and they come yeah. down from the trees once a week, do yeah. a shit, yeah. and then yeah. why would you not just shit off the edge of the tree? Exactly, I would. I've shat off the edge of a, of a tree. Do you remember that <laughs> don't video? Don't shit in here, but they say don't shit where you sleep. Yeah, but he's not. It falls they out. They sleep out. in the trees. Yeah, he's not. They're not. Yeah, I suppose, suppose if it, they're dumb, they don't know. <laughs> I suppose just... if it hits a branch or like his mate below yeah. it, yeah, it, it wouldn't be too fucking. Anyway, yeah. so. Horse gorillas are just bonkers. That's it would mad. be so cool if they still existed. Like, imagine having that instead of a horse. Right in this motherfucker. The one on the far left looks a bit like a kangaroo. Yeah, it does. Yeah, like yeah, yeah, it does. It's a but shame th- th- this slow. is slow. But this is a, what I mean about like we only have the bones to go on. You look yeah. how different. Like that's that, those two are the exact same species, but the ears look different because obviously the ears don't preserve. You don't yeah. Have... So is it only North America? 
I don't know where Chalico Theorem comes from. Oh, fucking hell. What? Just, just call probably, it Gorilla Probably, it could be... I would say if rhinos and tapirs are from Africa, it's probably African. Why is Latin the prevailing like thing to call from Because back, back in the day, um, Latin was like educational speak. Because back in the day, like... Think about it, like when you're medieval, yeah? All of like the cool texts aren't written in English because English people were dumb back then. Like, it was all written in Latin. Back then? Yeah, because the, it was the Romans that did all the cool like science shit, that copied all the Greek documents. Is that what so the Romans used Latin. then? They all spoke, they all, it was all Latin. Yeah, because they were Latin, that's where it comes from. So that's it, the Romans. No. So anyway, <laughs> who speaks that's Latin? What they call it, that's what they call Apart it. Apart from like people from Eton. Uh, yeah, that's Spanish it. is Latin, Italian's Latin. Not entirely. I think, I think Bulgarian's Latin as well. Not, yeah, Bulgarian? not entirely. They just take little bits like we do. No, no, no. It's descended from Latin. It's, yeah, it know, is but, Latin. Yeah, I know, but why still use it? Because it's just posh people shit. I don't fucking know. You know what I mean? Like posh people just love posh shit. Like, yeah, they do. Oh, I can speak Latin. Yeah. it's a dead oh. language. Oh, but I can speak it. Mm. Oh, great! I'm oh, preserving the old ways. Yeah, yeah. yeah they like they like that shit. Like, that the anyway, we're the moving on. Shit. To apart from Christmas, we're moving on to the Cam- <laughs> and Halloween. They're good traditions. We're moving on I to like the, the Cambrian, which is like the first geological part of history where like complex life existed. And this what, thing this isn't com- is called a- What the fuck is that? <laughs> nah, that's something made on spore. <laughs> nah, this is a hallucinogena, alright? It's called literally hallucinogena, which is like hallucination, I don't know. Because that's something from spore. They argued for a long that's time where Kylie what Jenner this and is. All them lot, they so look at this motherfucker. One of these. What the fuck is that? This is likely the ancestor of uh, what they call velvet worms. It looks like, you know, those like medieval mm. barricades that they would put up that were just like spikes on big yeah. stick. Like, there was a huge argument yeah, for, like for a long day. time <laughs> over whether those were spines on top of them or have a leg so that they could flip over or not. <laughs> nah. Yeah, let's see. Nah, there, cool. there was like a huge argument over Like it a 360 ages. millipede. Yeah. Why has it got like but a they, testicle for a head? That's just the way. Because this is before like advanced life. So. Before this, it would have just been like a shitty little. Do they have eyes? Uh, yeah. yeah. Uh, do you know if, yeah, uh, did, if yeah, scientists yeah. ever found anything because this is called hallucinogenic worm or whatever it is? Little, little, oh, little yeah. dots of eyes. Um, have, the, have scientists ever found an animal that you can eat that is hallucinogenic? Well, from the past. Yeah, Frogs, ever. toads. Yeah, no, but you toads. lick the back of toads, you get yeah, toads. Like, oh, I'm yeah. such an yeah. idiot. Toad liquor. Yeah. Yeah, and uh, what's what's that horrible stuff inside pufferfish that just mangles you? I think that's just like a poison. It like it only gives you hallucinations in the way that dying gives you hallucinations. No. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I mean? No, no. So anyway, these are like very very early well, life. That's one of the dumbest things. I've this ever is said. very very early life. So like so this is before even you know like lobsters or any of that dumb shit existed. This is like really really ancient shit. I actually got to see a specimen of this. I went up to Oxford to see the early life exhibit. Yes, and it was incredible. Did you have to like say a Latin password? Yeah, they, they, they also in, had like... yeah, yeah, and they had a kim- a Kimberella, which is like before Cambrian. It's like really rare shit. So anyway, cool. I've stuff. seen that Disney movie. Go on. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, we're going on to ter- pterosaurs. Had a glass I'm going on the fucking pterosaurs. Yeah. I'll tell you why. Pterosaurs are not dinosaurs. They no. they have a common ancestor that is, but they're not actually dinosaurs. Every time I think I've seen the weirdest <laughs> one, you then show me something ridiculous. Okay, mental. So what this the fuck is so is mental. That? This is a Quetzalcoatl, um, and that? it was the la- Quetzalcoatl, Quetzalcoatl. It, it's it's like oh uh, yeah. Anyone who's this great, remember John Ra. And it, charisma. That is how you say that. I, I, the ch- charisma. That was from when I was a little kid. Don't bring that you up. Still right? You still fucking say that shit. I don't say. You I say, don't don't say char. Sh- I don't say charisma. Right? You say John Ra. John Ra is John Ra. Like Jean Michel Jarre. Jean Michel Jarre. You know, it's, it's <laughs> you know, you know, there's, a, there's a million things that you said John wrong. Ra. <laughs> what do you think? What do you think? Is it Genra? Genra? How the fuck do I pronounce it then? Gen- Genre. Genris Khan. John Ra. Yeah. John. John Ra. John Ra. Yeah. No, genre. Genre. Anyway. Talk so, about the big bird. So this is the biggest flying animal to ever exist. That thing flew. Oh, it's got <laughs> wings. That like Yeah, I got I got one of it. That's un- How did it start? That is did it, it have to jump human, off cliffs? That's the largest bird to ever exist, which is an Argentavis Argentavis, I don't fucking know. Uh, that's the biggest dragonfly to ever exist, if you ever wanted to know. Holy fuck. Imagine I think that's more terrifying than imagine a dragonfly. Oh like, yeah. 
the size of you your You know what I was saying, like, back in the day, oxygen, there was more oxygen in the atmosphere. Ah. That's when these motherfuckers exist. That so, been, so I'd rather live we, with the big animals. So back then we would have eaten insects, surely. Well, this was long before we were around. No, no, but if if we if, we if were. they were still around, oh yeah, yeah, we would. It would have been an abundance of food. I mean, it would have you know, been like the Lion King went to Moan and Pumba eating all them fucking mm. bugs. If you had a It'd cockroach just like, that. like that big, do you know what I mean? Yeah, just flip it, it and it have, dude, that's a, that's there, 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 was, there were like yeah. there were like millipedes the fucking length of this room back then and shit. Like oh, that. it makes yeah, me feel man. weird. That that was the time of the insects. I don't like it. And then the reptiles evolved and started eating them all. But anyway, that is fucking huge. Qua- my um Qua- one, of, one of my professors was like the expert on um on these animals literally and his theory which is now generally accepted as like the actual you know theory theory that's it fine that's unbelievable first off we found that they actually were covered in like a light little fur which is something that most people don't know about how can they all. find that out just because through... you can find little imprints of uh, of the skin sometimes preserves if you're really lucky. Bones preserve really well, but skin and fur not very well. But if you're lucky, it does. Like feathers, we know. Like for ages, we thought our oh, dinosaurs, yeah, they're just scaly monsters until we started finding little imprints of feathers. What most of them would have had feathers. Most dinosaurs, yeah, apart from like Stegosaurus and all that. But like T Rex, maybe. But for, I for, do remember seeing Velociraptors like look like fucking turkeys, man. They were covered in feathers. So anyway, um. My point is, and they can't that open is, doors around imagine them. seeing that. That's flying about. That lands on your fucking roof. We are so lucky that these motherfuckers don't exist anymore. Uh, uh, yeah. We need to stop saving shit and just let it die. Look at that. If Look this happens that. again, we're ruined. If a seagull can fucking flip up oh, a... Imagine that. If, yeah, exactly. What can that eat? That can eat a fucking <laughs> elephant. Dude, that would just eat, eat humans easily. Yeah. Oh, God. Think it would be like bugs to it. So anyway, um, oh, I don't like that. Oh, I don't like <laughs> it. Terrifying. Anyway, scroll yeah. away. No, anyway, the, 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 scroll away. The, delete no, it. The, the delete that, that fucking no, photo right the, now. The theory that my, my that bird. The theory that my professor <laughs> came up with is that um, they were too heavy to just. You know how birds yeah, they, yeah. they start flapping and then they fly. Mm. They were too heavy for that. So what they did instead. These huge arms they use to vault themselves into the air and then fly. That is so fucking terrifying. That's cool. That's so terrifying. That's cool. Vault themselves into the air and then fl- you know, like, that. Why did they just that? And they didn't run. They might have run as well. They because the thing is, pterosaurs actually lived on the ground quite a lot as well as flew. So they were like ground. They lived on the ground and in the air. So well, why don't they just, if I was a bird, I would just find somewhere really high to jump off. Trust me, easier. It wasn't easy back then. Mate. It was. There wouldn't have been too much high. Mate, we think that like life's then, brutal really? nowadays. It was so much worse back then. No, man. Anyway, from one flying fucking reptile to another, this is a weird one. I only added it because I was like, <laughs> I remembered it the other day, and I was like, oh, he's just, it's just weird. Anyway, he, like, he, he's flying with his legs. <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck? That's what it looks like Lewis when he stretches his balls. <laughs> so these these <laughs> when Lewis does the bat wing. <laughs> so most, most animals are smart. That's so stupid. <laughs> yeah, most most animals when they when they evolve to glide are smart and use their arms. Yeah, I know. That it looks like dumb. this idiot. <laughs> <laughs> this idiot. <laughs> like, that's so it's, it's, quite, it's quite clear why it, he, he didn't survive. Oh, the no. did. Dude, that it looks like someone's cut a fucking. That doesn't look like right. A, like a, a lizard for, in half. For, for people listening, this, fucking... this is a fucking dinosaur. Not dinosaur. It's a reptile. Not well. It's, it's a reptile, basically, that grew. Membrane between its legs so that it could it's glide. It's so out of proportion in every like how, when that thing was on the floor. How did it walk? Did it just drag those big legs behind it and like crawl on its? That like, had to be a glider. How did it move? Like that had to be a glider. There's no. Yeah, way it, was a gl- yeah it was a glider. Yeah, it was a glider. Because see, that glider. there doesn't look so weird. The other one looks like, funny. That's <laughs> meant to. <laughs> but but <laughs> that isn't. <laughs> The other one kind of looks a bit like a sort of dragon. Yeah, like, yeah, that's kind of cool. Yeah, yeah. it's kind of dragony. But the yeah. other one looks dumb as fuck. It's stupid, isn't it? It's stupid little. It's arms. terrible. I so you can see that was yeah. quite a, a a dead end evolutionary. It yeah. never had any ancestors. Oh, yeah. It just kind of yeah, it stops died. right there, doesn't it? So anyway, on to another ancient animal. This one is called 
Oprah Beanie. Oprah. I don't, are you guys watch Teletubbies? Yeah. Yes. You know, you're Nunu? not about to. You know, Nunu. Motherfucking Nunu. Look at this motherfucker. All right. <laughs> he got a fucking like trunk. With, like, with a little Casper, and he sucked, he crushed stuff up, sucked it up. That's, That's cool, insane. isn't it? What's that on his head? He's got like buttons, eyes. buttons on his head. Those are eyes. eyes. Yeah, those nah, are eyes. they're not eyes. Yeah, eyes. Yeah. This is, I don't, I don't know exactly the evolutionary relationship. Well, it looks this. like uh, um, them seawood lices. What are they called again? Oh, I know. Our what favorite you animals. Mean. Oh, bucker buckers. Yeah, what are they called? Uh, just like wood, like wood, uh, wood loses. Wood loses. That's what me and my mate call them. I don't know if that's the actual name of them. Wood they, have, they do have a name. Yeah. I, I think I, I know what I you mean. filmed it in a video. Hang on, I'm gonna look it up quickly. Yeah. Anyway, so these guys, um, these came from the Cambrian as well. You know the the ancient times that the other one came. Oh, from. the big jewelry thing. Yeah. Right, yeah so yeah. here's another one. This more. Whoa. Nicer looking. It's hard to say what they exactly look like. Like I said, but we know they had a little clasp of trunks. So is that not a real? Fo- that's not someone's made mm. that. Like. Because that looks like a real photo. No, that someone's made that, like, but is really good at making. That's this fucking photo. nuts! It looks real. Yeah, but that's 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 good. That that gives you a good insight to what this would have looked like if you saw one in real life. Only problem if you saw one in real life though, is that it was very small. Uh. But everything back then was this small. One thing that you see all these cool fossils from the Cambrian, and you're like, oh, that looks really cool. Giant isopod. But actually, they, all of this these animals were tiny. It wasn't until. You know, into the late Cambrian, that animals started growing okay, big. Bigger. So back, you if you went to like early, early life, you'd go in the ocean, you'd be like seeing all these little things moving about. But those things would later evolve into the massive things we see today. It would have been like you know in Spy Kids three, where Steve Buscemi's got that little zoo, and I've he's got never like seen Spy mm. Kids. You've never seen Spy Kids? Any of them, dude? Maybe the first one. I've, I've definitely seen Spy Kids, but I don't remember. Steve Buscemi was in the third one, and they're like on an island, and he makes like a little zoo, and it's got like all tiny, like looks like a tiny gorilla and a tiny giraffe, and like, but they're all alive, like, yeah. So anyway, like, this is you know, early life was crazy, all right. But the, he's the, sucking up. There was, there is. Well, they call him uh, uh, Tubby, Tubby pancakes. Tub, tub, tubby custard. Tubby pancakes. Yeah, they made yeah, pancakes. They made pancakes, pancakes and they got toast waffles. Toast. Tub, tubby toast. Tubby toast. Tubby toast. I had a tubby toast maker when I was a kid. Like, where you cut the toast out. Do you still have it? Yeah. <laughs> no, I wish I did. Ah, oh, we can make some. Time so for tubby custard. Time yeah, like tubby custard. Like I said, like dinosaurs are cool, but this oh, shit, oh, this, oh, this oh, lived. The gap between us and dinosaurs, yeah. Mm. This lived like thirty times that ago, you know. Like, well, probably not that much. Twenty two. No. So this is really ancient shit, and I think like this probably evolved. I don't. I'm not sure. Like, this is probably closely related to. Um, I don't know, like arthropods. You know, like what's an arthropod? Arthropods like um, lobster sort of shit. Oh, okay, right. Arthropod, like, isn't like it? Like exoskeleton y. We've had this discussion, I can't pronounce shit right, alright? Don't be a little smug motherfucker in the corner. Yeah, we... I'll come over there oh, and I'll get that oh, smugness right oh, over you. Me being smug, huh? <laughs> anyway. We, we argued like... before this like twice, didn't we, Lewis? Yeah. Mm. So, anyway. Prick. That's the ninth one. So, this is the last one now, okay. guys, already. Oh. Show, us. Show us, let's go. This one is more recent. This lived 600 years ago. Si- Dodo. These are mowers, and that is a Hass eagle. That is the largest eagle to have ever existed. It was mowers. Massive. Yeah. So this eagle was massive. This is a Maori. Oh, shit. Mother. These guys come from New Zealand. Now New Zealand was so isolated from other countries for literally millions of years that no mammals lived on it. The only thing that lived on it were birds. So everything was birds. All right. <sighs> Okay, Fuck this is off. great. So these massive birds, the Maori's come and they. Fucking... Is that a real photo? No, 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 no. I was gonna say that's. But that's yeah, that's a good photo for six hundred years. Oh yeah, six hundred. Years. <laughs> years. <laughs> he's coming. <laughs> he's coming. He's coming. He's coming. He's coming. I he's forgot he said six hundred <laughs> years. I just... <laughs> but you know, you said a minute ago. You said a dumb fit. Like I've just blown you out of the water. That's all right. No, so we, we so, these, dumb so these were like super. Ma- these were super massive ostriches, essentially. Uh, I know where this is going. Because you know, you know what kiwis, yeah. You know kiwis? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like they're like Indian. they're basically giant kiwis. That's unbelievable. Reason. But anyway, that is so, so tall. yeah, these were the eagles that lived on them, and they were the biggest. Lived eagles on that, them. Yeah, they were living, but like eating them. 
Oh, that was right. their I food. You meant Not they were like, no, 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 like no. banjo kazooie, and they're just like they're like no. two, <laughs> two animals that are intertwined with each other. Yeah. So uh, as soon as the moa was, because it's New Zealand, like it took them only a few hundred years really to hunt them all. Down. Yeah. And they ate all of them. Yeah, they look pretty tasty. That's a lot of meat as well mm. for yeah. your little tribe or whatever. Like. So anyway, yeah. So they got hunted to extinction. It's one of those things that like it existed so recently. Literally, these. Things still existed while Leonardo da Vinci was still alive. All right, that's mental. Fourteen hundreds of these went extinct. That's fucked. But no one yeah. ever hears about it. Everyone hears about the fucking dodo, stupid little bitch bird, big chicken. Like it probably didn't even taste that good. They're cooler, and yeah, you could cooler. definitely ride them. You get, you could get. Oh, home. you could ride one of those. Oh, yeah. yeah, yeah, easy. You can ride an ostrich. Of course, you can ride that. I bet it was yeah. quick. I think it's one of those things that... Can you imagine that thing coming at you? Actually, then again, maybe it wasn't that quick, because if they just killed them all and ate them... They... uh, To me, that's a dinosaur. Well, yeah, because it's descended from dinosaurs. Yeah, no, but to me, it just is so similar to a dinosaur. It's just... What is it? It's it's got a big big stomach, a longer neck. Mm. No, it's it's lost its arms. It's cool, though, isn't it? Oh, yeah. Anyway, so those nice. those are some cool animals from. Well done, pre- Greggy. Well done, Greggy. That was very good. Very I've educational. A lot. That was educational. And some cool animals. The thing is that, like, like I said, like dinosaurs are so cool because you know teeth and you know the big scaly lizards that eat you. You watched Jurassic Park, haven't you? I mean, that's pretty cool. Mm-hmm. So, I understand it, but there's still have a cool shit. Yeah, we are definitely we have a very. If you're not like studying that stuff, I think we have a very limited. Very narrow, yeah. It's a T Rex and a. If it's not being a Jurassic Park, then no one knows. Yeah, yeah. Greg, do you have enough for another one in the future? Mm. I don't know. I'd have to do some research and have a look. But it's cool, isn't it, man? You might hear some more. Thing is, I'll probably do the boring ones. Like, you know, I'll be showing you like this cool jelly that's like, but it's it's jelly, but it's bilaterally symmetrical. So that's really cool because like back then. What are you talking about? What do you mean symmetrical jelly? What okay, so like imagine. About? Okay, so you know my. <laughs> Wait. Okay. Are you let me, describing let me, let me, a pork pie? Okay, look, look at my on? phone. Yeah, my phone is symmetrical, isn't it? You, yes. So you can divide it down one side. I understand and the symmetry. Yeah. I don't know what you mean by jelly, though. So look at uh, what are they called jellyfish. Oh, oh, okay. They're radially symmetrical. Yeah. But we're bilaterally symmetrical. No, I've so we're like we got it. left and we got a right. <laughs> We got left and the right, yeah. Yeah, I hate jellyfish. And but the, the thing oh, is, is that we that... don't know when that evolved, and when that evolved, that's when you get head, bottom. Yeah. Place to put brain, place to put eyes. That's what really kicked off like and we don't animal know evolution. That we don't know when that happened. So we have some fossils that look like jelly, but the cool thing about them is that they have a left and a right, and that's cool. Super cool. Yeah. <laughs> I think it's cool. I don't know. I don't really give a shit what you Symmetrical guys Jelly is going to be the name of my band if I ever make one. Anyway, guys. <laughs> no, well, yeah, what are we going to talk about now? I finished No, nah, that was good, that was Greg. Good. That was good. I'm, that was I, really I'm good. Just, you know, the, the main thing about prehistory is... It, it was history before history. Yeah. And, and, <laughs> and, and, Why and do you, they call it that? Prehistory. That is a pre- dumb name. Because before before his, his, history <laughs> is like human history. Why? So prehistory... Why? That's speciesist. No, it's not. History talks about recorded history, like history that we've recorded through language. Oh, yeah. So prehistory is anything that dates back before language and civilization. What's post-history? That's the future. No. Hmm. Yeah, Lewis, tell, tell me what post-history is. Yeah, Lewis. Post-history is yeah. that the thing? Post-history. Yeah. It must be the. Must be the future, mustn't it? Post-history. I don't understand. You're making my brain hurt. Ian, I can't he's, deal he's with doing, this shit. Doing, he's doing perfect. I'm just whining. Yeah. Doing, it's, not, it's just future, isn't it? Right, yeah. I think, history. Yeah. You made me feel dumb then. I don't like that. The thing is, is that, yeah, life is just weird. And the thing is, is that we're so used to what we see today, like lions, tigers, yeah. whales. Bears. That, oh, my. Uh, would we think, but then again, some of the shit, like, imagine being in the ocean with that fucking massive jawed motherfucker. He's going to eat you up. No. No. I think that's way more terrifying than the fucking Great White. See, that, that's one thing I was thinking about. You know, like aliens and that, where we're, we're all like, we can't sort of get our head around what they look like. But if we grew up with them, it's just like, oh, this is an alien. Yeah, thing. exactly. Mm. Yeah. It's weird how the human brain works. So I, 
I, for one, love all that kind of stuff. You're right, though, when it comes to animals. Well, not animals, like prehistoric animals. Better than dinosaurs, I reckon. Dinosaurs? More yeah. interesting. Oh, Dino- hell yeah. yeah. Dinosaurs- Funnier looking, too. Yeah, and that's, that's the thing is that it, the, the, the further you go back in time, the weirder everything gets. Because, mm. like... Nowadays, especially for like maybe the last two hundred million years, everything sort of looks the same because mm. it's like two eyes, two arms, it, two legs. Yeah, it's like we mm. fa- like we found what works the best, what mm. gives the best survival chances. But we the experimentation. Then, yeah, period. yeah, that's the, like, do you know what it's like? It's like we're in like the semi-finals of the X Factor right now. Yeah, and yeah. that was all like that was the auditions. Do yeah, you know what I mean where all the weirdos came in and they were like, yeah, they're just like, like, well, we're just gonna that's chuck that's shit. We got see what we got the best. I got a question for you actually. When they yeah. find an animal for the first time, yeah, how do they know it's not like you know like imagine if only one human skeleton was ever found, but it was someone who had no arms and no legs, and it was just a torso. Mm. How can they tell the difference between that one animal? Hmm. I guess they wouldn't be able to. I guess. Do you know what I mean, though? I guess you no, have to find what, what... more than one. So in the future, if, if say if I was, <laughs> you can't I guess no make arms, an estimate. No legs. Mm. Yeah, and I'm buried. Mm. Okay. In two thousand years, there's no no other human skeletons. They just find that one buried torso head. But this would depend on like a huge. Do they have amount. to find like five of them to be? No, like, no. Right, that's a... Well, to know to know with accuracy what an animal looked like, hundred percent. But for example, let's say you found you know we're like some alien species with like you know like six dicks and a hundred arms or whatever. Yeah. We we see like just this torso and arms. We don't see the legs. The thing is, is that it would depend on a few things. First off, is if you know any other fossils like it. So let's say they found a chimpanzee chimpanzee fossil and you had really, legs. You really can talk about this, can't you? So say you, you found a chimpanzee fossil and it has legs. You'd see the, the massive similarities between the human and the, uh, the and the orangutan that it doesn't make any sense that suddenly that you would evolve no legs. That just doesn't really work. That's not how biology works. So you would mm. see the, this, you know, this orangutan with legs, and you'd be like, okay, so maybe this other fossil one once was... had legs. Yeah. Okay. And we, it was just missing part of it. I got another question. So if, um, if you say some of them have like kept fur and yeah. skin and sort of stuff like that, has it ever has it ever been gelatinous stuff? Well, like fat. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, fat they found fat. You found like not lot, not fat itself, but things that indicate fat. So, are you saying that like fossilized human, you could see it there, wee wee? That is the testicles and that. It's plausible that you could get preserved in that way. Yeah, but cool. but but what? Come on, it's difficult. You know, like the the way the thing is is that uh, on land especially things don't preserve. As great as underwater, uh, like a lot of the the gr- best dinosaur fossils we have are ones that have died in like mud flats and stuff yeah. like that, where they get submerged really quickly. Tar pits. and there's like no, um, there's not really much bacteria that's going to eat you down yeah, there. Yeah, yeah. So your body preserves for Just a long, long time. Sticks and under it, there, like. Like, if we get some motherfuckers like that, yeah, we're going to have balls, we're going to have penises, we're going to uh, measure it, maybe you know, get the circumference, even check the foreskin length, everything. <laughs> you, there's a lot of things you can get out of it, you know, and like like I said, the best dinosaur fossils, especially the ones... If they found you in a mud flat, would be fucked, wouldn't it? It'd be yeah. a massive foreskin and three nuts, like, they'd think we were fucking... <laughs> yeah, they, and they, if they found no other <laughs> yeah. indication... They'd be like, oh, three testicles. Jesus, yeah. His testicles. The um, missing link. <laughs> So, well, I can't even remember what I was fucking talking about now. Oh, yeah. So, best dinosaur, especially the ones where we found feathers. Mm-hmm. Usually from, like, they call it anoxic environments. Anoxic basically means no oxygen. So, low oxygen environments. Um, You're such a fucking point, Dexter. Are really, really good places to uh, for pres- preservation. So, if you, want, if you want to be preserved, go find, like, a tar pit or something. With your jump fucking... In. Weird tartan shirt, yeah, and your nerd glasses, your point dexter. The only thing you're missing is like one of them, like, like a pen holder, like, yeah, this. yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I need to get like a one of those, like, and I, I just need to dress like the guy from Jurassic Park, get, uh, get constantly a hat, using an aspirin, yeah. De- denim shirt, you know, yeah, 
little little like Hank like yeah band, he has like, that he has that yeah, little fucking, little red sort of yeah. like bandana necklace like neckerchief like I think I'd suit that actually. I think there's a prehistoric animal b- yeah, bounding yeah, around yeah, upstairs yeah, in your house yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, probably Darwin <laughs> <laughs> hey um That's probably is I've got another question you said that in the future we'd be able to see human penises and testicles only if they're preserved in that like a very very Where's the good dinosaur one. dicks? That's a good question, actually. Um, I actually don't know if we've ever seen a dinosaur dick. I you have in your I... dreams. I know you have. You fucking dinosaur bummer. I actually, I honestly <laughs> don't know. We come on. This is the first thing I would have asked if I did a painting dodge. Give me the dicks. Where are the dicks? <laughs> I'm gonna have to look this up. This is gonna irritate me. You, you There's don't... some animals that have bones that. In the penis. Yeah, yeah, penis bones. Yeah, penis. That you can buy. Oh, that's a re- re- good shout. We maybe they do have. I don't know. I don't. Like I said, I don't know much about dinosaurs because when I did what? paleontology, I didn't. I, I was trying to be as contrarian as possible. You know what I'm like. Yeah. yeah. I tried to avoid anything to do with dinosaurs mm. just to try and be cool. You wanted to look at all the weird shit. Yeah. And obviously, it worked Sorry. out in it. So, um, dinosaur penis. Yeah. Have we ever found a dinosaur penis? Because they must have had them. Because. Unless they had some weird well, way of reproducing we, we, well, that we don't know de- about. Birds are descended from them, so you know if we look at bird penises, I've seen pigeons fuck before. Mm. Have you? Yeah, yeah they I've were... seen it. Well, actually, like with you know, your like, eyes. You know, like road names in England, you got the little post with the road name on yeah. it. Yeah, they were just you fucking saw the same pigeons. Time, yeah, just fucking, yeah, just fucking on the fucking mm. thing. Yeah. Look, the girl pigeon can do this thing where it's sort of like. <laughs> they move their butt feathers open, and then like the other, the male pigeons are like, yeah. <laughs> you know, like how you know how like it's like doggy style, mm, pigeon style. Yeah, pigeon style. Let's you rename it so we can both watch X Files. You get horny now, you and me, baby. Right. Yank. Where's Nothing these dinosaur dicks? Show yeah. me the dicks. Show, show okay. me the dicks. Okay. Um... <clears throat> but yeah, I was gonna buy you a toothpick. Made from a raccoon bone penis, but I never did. Raccoons have a bone in their penis. I think it's a raccoon. Raccoon bone penis. Yeah. Any luck, Greg? Unfortunately, mate. He's going to have to do some research into the dinosaur dicks. Some heavier research. The problem with dinosaur penises is that uh, when something preserves, if something's inside... Oh, oh, it might have been know. like a le- lizard penis. On the yeah, they, they have they have the same thing. Ah. Uh, it was a clo- 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 yeah. cloaca. Cloaca is cloaca, when it's a, yeah. a bum and a, a yeah. bum and a vagina all in one. Yeah, right? yeah, but that's where that's where the penis is for them. And if it's inside, it's the, like it's a turtle's o- head. It's only the skin that's going to preserve. It's not the mm. it's not the penis inside of it that's yeah. going to preserve. So I, yeah, I don't think we've ever found a. a whereas it's different with humans because you know we we hang on. We don't hide hide it. We, we Some hang of it. us do. Mm. We know. What I mean, like, yes. Yeah, even a small guy still hanging his dong. It's just not particularly hung. I don't know. There was this one time where I showed Lewis, like, was it Howard Stone's show? Like, who had the smallest oh, penis? Oh, yeah. And he kept messaging yeah. me. Or were you? Was it after I showed you and you saw me in person? You're like, I, c- I could not fucking believe how. No, I couldn't dong. believe. Really? Like, it, honestly, it was insane. I didn't know until you showed me. And I've tried because I've told people about that video, like that, like not haunted, but yeah. like I still think because it's like it's mental because it, I never knew they came. That like they, mm. you know, the South Park sketch where fucking Cartman's trying to get uh, Kyle to suck his nuts, and like you see Cartman naked and his dick is like. It's you can't even. It's just a dot. <laughs> Some of them were like that, just dots, nah. like like braille. I, don't I swear that. on, I Tiny. swear on no. my life. Tiny. They like they're like yeah, here it is, and all, everyone's like, where is it? I can't even see it, and he's like, nah. he's like, it's right there. Like small. It's dick. like honestly, I've it's seen like micro a, dicks. They're, they're like no, they're like, smaller. No, like, but these weren't like micro little, dicks. These were like they're like micro micro. These were ridiculous. Really? I'll try and find. We'll have to, I've tried to find. It was it on YouTube, but it's yeah, it's, it's oh, at, that's educational. Some of them are little, like some of them are just little chodes, and you're like, ha, ha. but some of them you can't see. Like they're almost like the, how you were saying with the dinosaur, like it's like the, a t- like a the tiny skin, like the gun. It almost like it goes in like. They have to like push yeah. like the to get it to cut like it's. So that's just not fatness. <clears throat> it's a blend. No, I think it's a mix. Some of them were just like their dicks were just. I think when you got a dick like that, like 
keeping in shape is pointless because as soon as you take your pants off, it's, <laughs> it's over anyway. It's over, yeah. You can't do anything with half of the honestly. And that show was so fucked as well though because like there's like women judges there and they're just like laughing. It's Dude, like Howard Stern's have always been the most bonkers. Oh, uh, it was savage. Bonkers show. Uh, Mate, growing up watching like bits of Howard Stern online, like and TV, t- TV and radio just used to be wild. Oh, mental. Yeah, yeah especially like, like mid noughty. No, uh, n- like 90s. Mid, mid 90s to mid noughties. Yeah, mm. it was just wild. Like WWE. You could, do, you could just do anything. It was a complete playground for just the crazy. South Park just was just, just come out. You know, like. Everything's really boring again. Yeah. It's like we've gone back to like, you know, the 70s. Not no, I feel 70s, like we're like, in the fucking like Georgian fifth, era. Yeah, like back in the 50s. Hell yeah. yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Actually, no. Everyone, you know, sex is. I know like, we. Yeah, way sex now. and violence is okay, but like real wacky shit is not. You know yeah, I mean? we don't have wacky stuff anymore. That's it's it. The not, wackiness I is gone. The wackiness, yeah. Oh, so like we've reined ourselves in. We're like, oh, that's a bit too much. Yeah. yeah just it's, 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 it's crazy shit. It's no, I agree. Like, I, I miss the crazy shit. For me, it's not like it has a nostalgia to yeah. it. Talking about crazy shit. We on Friday are going to watch the new Jackass movie. Jackass yes, number four. We are. Oh, I forgot about that. Yeah. I'm excited, man. I'm really excited. Are we going early. Uh, half two. We're going to go and see. Did I send you the money? Oh, that's not too bad. What's that? Yeah, you did. Yeah. All right, nice yeah. one. Anyway, guys, a hundred likes. Uh, go check us out on Spotify. Even, uh, please don't. You know. Uh, I I apologize to anyone who was just listening and not watching because you probably had no idea what just happened. <laughs> it was it was good. Yeah, we, we made, tried our best to explain we funny what we were seeing. And I mean, Greg pronounced all of them so well that you can just Google them afterwards anyway to figure out what. And fact, no, we'll, we'll, let's put a list in the, the description. If people, if, people if people don't care for it too much, we'll just make like fifty highlights out of this. We'll do a highlight for everyone that you showed us. <laughs> and that's a great way to, for me to tell you that we have a highlights channel. We do. Best link in the description. Do we? I know we were thinking about making one, but we yeah. made a highlight channel like a year ago. Yeah, I know, no, but I swear we, we never, we never put anything. No, on. there's five videos put, on there. Yeah, yeah, there you go. So, my but we are gonna be, videos. we are gonna be getting on um, doing more highlights. It's just fucking. I mean, we can hardly even like, we can't even meet up every week at the <laughs> moment. So to then we do our meet best, up but, yeah, and shoot a podcast and fucking edit it and get it out and get the highlights out as well, it's hard. But we are gonna look into the future at like maybe getting somebody to help us out with editing do you know what i mean to, you know help yeah, us out a little bit on the side but we're doing the best that we me. can but we promise that there are we're going to try and keep the podcast as regular as we can and we are going to start doing highlights and things and kind you know, of bum us like great bum dinosaurs anyway like you very bum like bum you very much and like this video mm. and greg liked bum, bum and dinosaurs technically yeah. you can't bum a dinosaur because they have a cloaca we yeah, but a cloaca is still a bum, isn't it? Is it's it just a bum or is it a penis or is it a vagina? What is the best dinosaur to get a blowjob from? I don't know enough none dinosaurs. Of none of them. I wouldn't put my penis Chomp. in any of them. Yeah. <laughs> 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 just, it's okay, like, goodbye. Yeah. We love you. <laughs> bye, 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 bye. That bye, thing bye. with the curly fucking jaw. <laughs> give you some oh, serious really. fucking. And get your get your balls in your ass. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, it's true. Give me, give me, your, give me your reach around. Fuck's sake.